Okay, so you clicked on the link for the explanation of what the heck was going on in this movie, Exam. Or maybe you just clicked on this because you saw that it said Exam Spoiler Give Away the Ending. Okay, I don't normally do this, but if you clicked on this, I hope you already saw the movie. If not, that's just stupid of you, okay? Alright, now, here's what it was. Right, this guy said to these eight people, after he gave them the rules, and all the rules, the rules were... And the only rules in here are our rules. There is one question before you and one answer is required. If you try to communicate with myself or the guard, you will be disqualified. If you spoil your paper intentionally or accidentally, you will be disqualified. If you choose to leave this room for any reason, disqualified. Any questions? He said any questions. Now obviously nobody could answer that question because if they would have said yes they would have been disqualified and kicked out because that is an answer that is saying something to him. So get it? So they couldn't say yes. So no questions are now asked through the whole movie you you want to know what the one question is and that was the question does anybody have any questions that's the one question and then you find out at the end of the movie hidden in the paper it said question one and a lot of people confused like what do, what do they mean only one question some people thought the answer was oh there's a question followed by one answer and the answer is one no the answer was no and that's what blonde said so at the very end she goes the answer is no because the question was does anybody have any questions okay hi i came back on here even though i'm getting ready to do some other reviews because there's some questions unanswered that i realized people had um okay how come blonde blonde won when the timer ran out and she was outside the room well let's rewind when white started talking because he figured he was the last man standing after he shot and did all what he did um, well, he didn't have the answer anyway, but let's say he did have the answer. Um, he spoke before he could give the answer. He said, you should pick me, blah, blah, blah. I forgot exactly what he said. But anyway, let's go to the timer. Def, who was behind this whole thing, who was in the room with them, the guy with the glasses, he went over to the timer and hit a button, which sped the time up. It has two buttons on it, one that resets it and one that speeds it up. He sped it up, so everybody thought it was, um... That was the actual time. So when the timer ran out in the room, they thought that was it. It was over. So White was like, well, you pick me, pick me. It's already over. And Blonde's outside the room. Well, it wasn't over because when he looked at his watch, he saw there was time left because the timer sped up. The rules go by 80 minutes, actual 80 minutes, the real time. Not just because someone made the clock faster and fooled them. It was the real time, which there was still time left. And he spoke, so that disqualifies him. Blonde noticed there was a few seconds left. I forget how many. Um, and she said the answer is no. She qualified. And for those of you who say she was outside the room, watch the movie again. She was not. Her foot was still in the room. She was outside in the hallway, but her foot was in the room, qualifying her. Hence, that's your answer. Well, uh, any questions? Answers no. Blonde gets it. She wins. Check and mate. All right. Great movie, man. So I hope everyone else enjoyed it. hope this explains it for those who had questions and, and couldn't figure it out. Anyway, I'm Cinema Dan. Trust the beard. See you next time. Oh, one last quick thing. Um, if you watch this whole uh, ex explanation of exam and you didn't see the movie, you're a retard. Okay? You should watch the movie. I did this for those who had questions of it. And I hate people that ruin movies, watch the end of movies, read the end of books, whatever. I'm coming to your house personally. If you watch this without seeing the movie, I'm going to rip out every last two pages of every book you own that you have not read yet. And I'll make sure that you never get to see an ending again. Ha <laughs> ha! Whatever, see you later. Just don't be a jerk. Watch the movie first. Well, for those that don't read, I'm coming to your house and erasing the last minute of all your DVDs. All the ones you didn't watch yet. If you try and get them on demand, I've already contacted the, your cable provider. You'll never see ends of the movies ever again. That's what you get for being a jerk. I'm Cinema Dan, I can do that stuff. Later. To everyone else, hope you liked the movie. Hope you liked this explanation. See you later.